And of course I spit up time and I forgot I was selling and I'm selling for 40 fucking cents. <laughs> well, welcome to me. I'm, I'm really good at fucking up those prices. What's going on everybody, Dragas here, and welcome back to another episode of Turmoil. So, if you missed the last episode, go and watch that thing, because man was that ever an eventful episode. We found a diamond, we had two perfect seasons, it felt good after all the fails that I've had <laughs> throughout this playthrough. Uh, but yeah, it just feels good to do well again. So here we go, let's go back to the stock auction. Let's hope for a decent one here, because I got a decent amount of money. 4% share, not going to complain with that. We're currently in the lead at 18%, but Joshua and Ricardo, very close behind us. Uh, we're at a little bit about Joshua right now, because he got $52,000. I'm thinking, I'm going at like 34, right in the middle here. And I'm hoping Joshua isn't overly aggressive. He might be. And you know what? I might be risking it, but there we go. I spent a lot of money to earn that, but now I'm actually way more comfortable because technically I'm about two stock biddings ahead. I mean, generally it doesn't go over 5%, so that feels good. Now, the downside of that is it means our thermal upgrade is uh, pretty much not going to happen. Well, obviously not going to happen this season. We got $32,000 and it's $60,000. Might not even happen next season, though, because, well, we had a really good season, but we also had a really bad season. Uh, on this land auction as you can see let me show you I had a 12 yield the first time I thought it'd be smart to go down here not smart to go down there definitely not smart to go down there it's seeming like the uh, northern left side is is the prime spot so you know what I'm going to bid hard again for some of these decent spots uh, because it is getting so competitive especially in the tundra uh, most of the other seasons it's very similar throughout the whole map but you can see down here it's 12 up here it's fucking 70 so you really want to start bidding for some of these in my opinion uh, when you get this late into the game. Now, ah, oh, fuck, you can see, the problem is I would go up here, but obviously it drops off like crazy. So, Joshua has this one for 5,000, Ricardo has this one for 6,000. I'm feeling like this is a better one. I'm gonna do one more bid, hopefully. If, oh, fuck. Ricardo, you're an asshole. Okay, you know what? We're going for the cheap one. Let's hope for the best here, and hopefully nobody takes it. Man, they are really fucking bidding this year. 12,000? Are you kidding me? I mean, it's probably pretty smart. You know what? Let's just go... Fuck it. We'll go right here. Why, why not, right? Let's just try it. Take some risks every now and then and not try and waste all my money on these land bidding. So there we go. Uh, another season here. Let's get it going and hope for the best. All right. Feeling good about it. Feeling good about it. We're going to hire some moles early on. We generally don't do that in the Tundra for whatever reason. At least I haven't been. Oh, I forgot about my diamond. I probably could have spent my diamond, uh, but I guess we will next season okay we got two dowsers waving right here there we go that's a good sign let's spread this pipe out and find those two got this guy over here as well i can hire some more dowsers right now but i think i'm gonna wait a little bit because i'm feeling like maybe this ground might be a little bit dry but maybe not either oh that is a mother load i can tell you that that's one connected and that is a big old beast yes okay well that's a good feeling let's get some of these wagons selling uh so i don't need to get as many loans i'm so curious at how big this thing is but i'm sure we'll find out later on uh so i'm not gonna waste these scanning costs to figure that out uh, I'm gonna sell a few for 84 cents here just because I can and uh, yeah, let's hire actually Oh, I meant to hire a dowser. I keep hiring wagons instead of dowsers. I'm gonna hire two more dowsers and I'm gonna hire a couple more moles as well. Find some more gas nodes Okay, we got two dowsers waving over here. Oh, it's looking like this one's probably this one way down here So I'm gonna spend the money to go to that one because it looks quite large this one over here. I don't even know Hmm, it's probably deeper because uh, these moles pretty much cleared all this part. So yes, there's something right there. So we're gonna go. Oh fuck, I hit a rock. Okay, hire some more wagons. We're having uh, some spillage issues. Well, almost spillage issues. And let's put a silo by right ink right now. Okay, well I need some money. I already took out fifteen hundred dollars worth of loans. So fuck it, I'll do it. Whatever. Sometimes you just gotta spend money, you know what I'm saying? I just wanna get that drill through rock so I can connect to this, because these two over here are looking like they're pretty big. Oh yes, oh yes, that is that that is a very nice <laughs> That's a very nice node. I don't I, I can't even talk sometimes in this game, I'm so excited. Okay, this guy's been waving for a little while. I'm hoping his it's not up high, unfortunately. Um I might need to build another rig. Oh, come on, it's really small as well. I didn't want that. 
Um, and of course, I'm gonna have to drill through rocks. So the big question is, do I connect both my pipes together? That's 640 bucks. Uh, is it really worth it, or should I just try and traverse through this rock? Okay, yeah, I think my best bet is to connect both of these together. So we're gonna do that right now, and hopefully this pipe will find some gas nodes along the way or something. Obviously, not hit them. Uh, but at least find something. It looks like it found a lot of fucking rock. <laughs> That's for sure. There's just a whole rocky cl cliff face there. Uh, but now both of our nodes are connected together. I'll be able to go to this one and pull out this oil. Uh, 86 cents. Okay, left writing did go over. Let's uh, let's do two wagon selling, most of them storing. Uh, also, oh, fuck. I forgot about this guy over here. Holy shit. I, I, there's too much going on in this fucking game sometimes. Uh, but yes, we got another very big node here, I'm actually thinking at this point. It's April. These are some fucking large nodes, guys. <laughs> like, all three of these are just, like, the ultimate node. I also noticed something. There's something right here. I'm assuming it's a... Oh! Hey, it's another oil node! So there's the other oil I thought he was waving for this one down here. I'm assuming he's waving for this little guy. Uh, so I guess we'll just connect to this like that. Okay, and that's gonna vanish that dowser. Let's hire one more dowser. I'm just gonna hire one at a time now. I don't know... How much oil is going to be in this ground? Also, I should probably upgrade this to a tier 2. Why the hell not? Uh, I don't have too much money to my name, but uh, I don't really need too much right now anyways. I would like to put this silo... Ah, oh, fuck. I'm not going to have enough space over there. So I don't think I'm going to be using super silos. Let's just put one beside left and right. Also, this guy found something, so let's hire another dowser and try and find what he found. Uh, maybe it's right here? It's probably right here. Ah, oh, yes! This is a good fucking land slot. This guy found something as well. I'm assuming it's below that. I'll, I think at this point, I should just start storing as much of this as I can. Uh, I, maybe I shouldn't do a super silo. Let's just do that for right now. We got a lot of silos, but I think I'm going to need them anyways. Also, I'm, I'm going to overflow here. Let's get it. Fuck it. More loans. We need lots of loans because I want to upgrade my wagons. Okay, let's see what this guy's waving about. Is it right down here? Yes, it is. It looks like another one, man. Oh, man, we are hitting them all. So I'm going to upgrade this to a tier two. And then connect that to this, and hopefully we can pull this out quick enough. It's June. It's halfway through the season. Man, some of these. I might need to even upgrade to Tier 3s here. Okay, let's hire a couple more Dowsers. At this point, I think it's just wasting time not hiring more Dowsers. Oh, shit. I got no money again? Okay, I gotta start selling at least a little bit. So we're going to uh, sell for a little bit here. Left Inks at 94 cents. That's not bad at all, because uh, I definitely need some money. There we go. We're all set up. We got a decent amount of money now. Still selling for $1.19. I'm gonna obviously going to keep selling right now. That is a, a great price. I heard another Dowser. Let's see if he finds anything. I think one walked off the screen, but I always miss that. You can see he's walking around now. Uh, it's looking like that is everything in the ground in terms of at least oil. Now, there could be some gas nodes, so let's hire quite a few moles here because we're going to try and uncover this ground. I, I believe also we were beside diamonds, so obviously I want a lot of moles here. Like, I, did, I think that's the most I've ever hired, so let's see. Oh, I love watching this. The moles just open up that ground. And of course I sped up time and I forgot I was selling and I'm selling for 40 fucking cents. <laughs> well, welcome to me. I'm, I'm really good at fucking up those prices. Okay, so I'm seeing we got a really big gas node here, a decently one here, a decently sized one here. Looks like we got four different nodes. So I definitely could do a gas push. The question is, which one do I want to do it to? Actually, I think I'm going to set it up to the point where I can do either or, because obviously that's a better idea. So there we go. We're going to do that, and we're also going to spend a little bit of money and connect to that as well. That way we're at least prepared for either one. Also, we need a mega silo here, or super silo. Because these guys are storing a lot of oil, and we're going to be bringing out a lot of oil as well. And I also want to connect these pipes together in a way that I could close my rigs and not close the whole system off. So we're going to put one there, one here. That makes it so everything's connected when I close the rigs. Now I just got to go towards all the gas nodes and prepare myself. So there we go. We spent quite a bit of money setting this up, but it's definitely going to be worth it, assuming one of these prices goes to a decent amount. Also going to upgrade my wagons right now just because I can. Uh, at this point, I'm definitely going to need to upgrade some of these as well. We're going to upgrade this to a Tier 3, upgrade this as well to a Tier 2, and upgrade this, this. A lot of upgrades, spending a lot of money this season, but obviously we kind of have to. We got a lot of fucking oil in the ground, guys. And that is all the silos I can have, so I'm going to have to boost this price soon. I'm looking at Left Ink, and it's pretty damn tempting right now. I still got a lot of oil in the ground, though, and I have to account for that. But I have also have a lot of oil out of the ground that I could use. So, 
I'm thinking this is probably going to be it here. $1.20 is very tempting. So yeah, let's close rigs off and get ready for this. Here we go. We're going to boost this price. It's going to be fun. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to close that. God damn it. I can't. I, I Honestly, I get nervous when I do this, so I keep fucking up, and it's so annoying. So I close that rig off, close both rigs off, push the gas through. Let's start selling. There we go. The price is... Oh, God. What's going on? Okay. It just seems way slower now. If I remember the past, like, when I boosted the gas, it was so much faster. But that's okay. We can just keep boosting it here. There we go. And, of course, got to keep boosting it. And the final one right here. That is all my gas. And let's hire a few more wagons to try and get this prime yield. Actually, we hire a few more wagons than that, man. We need lots of wagons because we are going to earn quite a bit of money here. There we go. A $2 price yield, not too bad. Uh, generally, I can sometimes get better, though. But, I mean, I'm basically selling a super silo for over $2. You can't really complain when that happens. So let's speed up time here and just watch the money come in. Yes! Sold basically all my oil above ground for over $1.50. That feels really good, but we still got a lot of oil in the ground, so let's open these suckers up again. And hopefully we don't have any overflowing issues. This is the confusing part. Okay, all the pipes are normal again. We got lots of wagons. It's the last month? Holy shit, I, I was not paying attention to the time, guys. Uh, I don't even know why I upgraded that. I'm not going to have time to deal with this. Oh my god! Hell the fuck! All right. Hold on, we gotta go to right ink here. I remember it from the last time, but it feels like it was, it's so much harder now. Maybe I'm just crazy. But, uh, yeah, we obviously are not gonna get all this oil out of the ground. We got a lot of it out of the ground. We sold a lot of it at a prime price. But I did waste a lot of time as well. Okay, there we go. That tier 3 pipe's hopefully gonna suck that thing out. I Actually, that's too late now. I was gonna try and find some more gas to try and push some oil through. But I'm thinking at this point, just sell as much as you can. Actually, we're gonna sell to both. Because this is a closer spot. I know it's 50 cents, but I'm trying to get as much oil sold as possible. So, uh, you know what? Let's drop that down a little bit. I would prefer selling to right ink, but some of them should stay at left ink as well. Okay, now we just wait it out. Unfortunately, I mean, not the perfect season, but uh, I did do a good gas run, so that felt good. We just had a lot of oil on the ground. We found everything, actually. It's unfortunate that I lost track of time there. Regardless, we got the bonus for all gas depleted and a profit of $40,000. Let's see how the competition did. I'm going to assume they did decent as well. Uh, yeah, that's good for them. 17, 15, and 13. So a lot of people have a lot of money right now. The race for the majority of stocks is getting exciting. Remember the, that the first person with 50% becomes the new mayor. Oh, I thought it was winning. I totally forgot that it was the first person the 50%. Hmm. Well, that's kind of interesting considering... All of us are really close right now. This is going to be a fight to the end. Uh, let's go and actually do another stock auction. I am going to have to be very aggressive. 4%. Uh, I currently have by far the high... Well, actually, Joshua's pretty high as well. And I, I think Joshua's going to be aggressive. So I'm going to bid at like 36. Uh, I have to be really high. This is a big share. And I do want to do that. So 36. There we go. I win it. Uh, now I'm getting way far ahead at least at 26%. Uh, the highest next is Joshua at 17. Okay, but let's go back to the land auction because I'm curious to see how these yields were. So, my yield was only 53. Uh, a lot of these guys fought for... Uh, they actually fought for these ones. Uh, they spent a lot of money on those ones. So, it feels good that mine was at least 53 and I think I only spent $2,000. The one above me was the one I was trying to go for. But, you know what? It's not really worth the added 12000 I think they paid for that spot. So you know what? I'm going to go right here. Guaranteed it's going to be... Yeah, I, I saw already been fought for. Uh, I'm thinking it's just going to get really fucking dry at the end of this game here. So I don't even know if I'm going to buy that upgrade because I want to get the 50% stock share if I can. So now I have a predicament. I don't really want to fight for this one. They, they're just going to keep fighting for it. So I can either go down here and hope that it kind of stays to the left side, or I can go here and hopefully that 38 vanishes and it sticks with these 50 ones. I don't think it is, though, so you know what? Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go down here and hope for the best. These guys are obviously gonna really fight for that spot. It's really the only good spot that's, uh, obviously available, so Blanche spent 50,000 to get it. Hopefully she can get something out of it. Also, we got our diamond. I keep forgetting we can, uh, uh do... Oh, is he not here anymore? He's not here anymore. The guy that would show me the good yields for the diamond. Of course he's not. So I could have used that diamond to increase my month last time and probably got all the oil out of the ground. I really should have done that. I, you know what? I don't even realize diamond strategies because I never have them. So that's, that's my main fault. Uh, but let's go out here. I'm not going to spend my diamond right now. I'm hoping that guy comes back to the saloon 
and uh, I can buy the yield thing. Okay, we got a guy waving over here, so I'm going to put a rig down, and uh, these dowsers, January 8th, generally they do it at like the 6th that there's lots in there, so I'm feeling like, yes, judging by how deep I have to go as well, this is probably dry ground. Let's actually censor it up if it's getting this to this point. There we go, that's a decently sized node at least. And let's put a silo right beside this rig. I'll probably upgrade that to a super silo depending on, you know, how much is in the ground. I'm currently selling a little bit. I was trying to earn a little bit of money, but it, obviously the prices are not good right now. So we're going to get a $2,000 loan, and hopefully we can find this other node. It's, please be right here. Okay, that's a little guy, but you know what? It's better than nothing. We're going to hire this. I'm going to hire a rig, guys. I'm going to buy a rig and uh, start looking for this one as well. Oh, yeah, this is not feeling like it's a good season, guys. Maybe I should have competed for that one plot of land. Okay, that's another... Eh, it could be a medium size. It's hard to tell right now. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't even know you could do that. Uh, we're going to hire a couple more dowsers, and let's do a few moles as well. Maybe we'll find another diamond. That would be great. Oh, yeah, that was like three whistles all at once. Okay, maybe I think my confidence has changed here. Maybe there's some uh, good nodes deep down. Uh, actually, that's a very big node. I'm judging by the moles, what they found. I'm assuming that's the same node. So, oh, I don't got any money. You got, I just got a $2,000 loan. Fuck, money goes fast. Okay, well, let's get another $1,000 loan, and I'm going to stop at that. Hopefully, prices will be decent by then. We're actually writing not too bad right now. Let's start selling, and I'm going to upgrade those wagons just because I'm going to need to anyways. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I didn't buy uh, upgraded rocks yet, or sorry, drill through rocks. So, do I want to wait for 300 Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to get another loan. It's not worth it. So, let's just speed up time here. And actually, left ink. Ooh, okay. I'm going to start selling at left ink. Okay, but now we can drill through rock. There we go. And I'm hoping this node isn't really friggin' small. But it's kind of looking like it. Oh, yeah, that is definitely a small node, unfortunately. But that's all right. Uh, it's better than having no nodes, I guess. Let's find this other one here. Hopefully, it's not another small one. Okay, I can see it. No idea the size of it, though, so we're just going to go right over to it. And we got this other guy waving over here. I don't know. All right, it's probably deeper down, so I'm going to do that. But if I don't find anything, which I didn't, let's hope for the best. Maybe it's up here. Who the hell knows? Nope, it's probably really deep, and that means I don't think there's much else in the ground. So I'm just going to hire one dowser for right now, and we're going to hire a couple more moles. Maybe we can find some gas in this ground for once. <laughs> oh, yes. Speak of the devil, look at that gas. No, that's a very decent size. Also, he found something as well. Okay, I do see one of the oil nodes. Let's actually speed up time and try and get a little sneak peek here. Uh, yeah, time goes fucking so slow, though. It's hard to tell. Okay, I think I'm just going to make the investment of a very large pipe. I could obviously... It might be worth it to do another rig, actually. With, with that pipe, it's $750. A rig's only $350. And I got two nodes here. So you know what? I'm just going to keep the workload evened out. And we're going to have three rigs going this season. Okay, all three rigs are connected. This other dowser guy has got to be, like, right... Uh, it's probably a little further down. Now, I don't really know what I should do with this season. We don't have a bad yield. Like, there's not... There's quite a bit of oil here. Actually, this node here looks quite large. Let's take a little sneak peek. Oh, yeah, we definitely want to want to upgrade. And I'm thinking maybe I should store a little bit of this. We got two decently sized gas nodes here, so I could do a gas strategy, but... Selling for a dollar eleven. Yes, we're gonna sell right now. I definitely need the money. Also, I should probably hire a few more wagons. I've had three this whole season. It's already June. But yeah, I think I'm gonna do a bit of a storage strategy because there's not too much in the ground, but there's enough to actually make uh, the gas nodes probably worth it. Uh, also, would really like to find this other dowser. Let's actually hire one more dowser. There we go. And see if he finds anything as well. Okay, that's dropping quite quick as you can see. I'm going to stop selling at about 80 cents because I do need the money right now. So I definitely do want to sell a little bit. There we go. And now it is time to make a super silo, I'm thinking. Because uh, we are going to start pulling quite a bit of this out of the ground really quickly. But yes, I did hire that other dowser. He did not find anything. So aside from this guy waving, this is all the oil in the ground. Uh, let's hire a few more moles. Actually, I see the node right now. It's right there. So we're just going to connect via... I don't know if I should do that. Actually, I'm going to upgrade this to a tier 2, and then I'm going to connect to this. So hopefully, it should get rid of all this oil by the end of the season. And time to make that super silo. We're going to need it anyways. So there we go. Everything's connected. The moles don't seem to be finding any more gas, which is unfortunate. Just going to keep an eye on these prices. Looks like everything's going good. Let's start selling a, at least a few wagons 
at 92 cents right now. Oh, did I upgrade that to a tier 3? I didn't mean to do that. Okay, well, I guess we're going to upgrade this to a tier 3 now to make it worth that. I'll, honestly, it's August already, and there's still a lot of oil in that ground, so it's probably a good idea that I did do that. Actually, what I might do, instead of doing the gas strategy, is try and boost this oil out of the ground. I do like doing that more often than uh, the actual gas strategy. So I'm going to hire a few more wagons, and I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to do that. That's, and some people say this is stupid. I don't care. It's fun. Uh, and, and I'm all about having fun in this game. So we're going to start selling. $1.11, yes, please. Let's start selling with a lot of this. And we're going to boost that oil out of the ground, because I do want to get as much of this as I can as early as possible. Actually, let's boost this as well. Oh, fuck. There's no fucking wagons here, guys. Okay, maybe I spent a little too much money on this because uh, I bought a lot of wagons. But also, I have a chance of getting the gas uh, depleted bonus, so that's obviously good as well. So this might be worth it. It might be stupid. I don't know. Sometimes I like using the gas. Sometimes I like waiting for those prime prices. Okay, there we go. We didn't have any spillage issues, I don't think. And all that oil, basically, in that node up top is gone now. That means this is going to connect to this one and start pulling a lot more out really quickly. Also, writing's at 92 cents. We're just going to keep selling here. I shouldn't have bought the Super Silo. I changed my mind mid-season, which is probably something I shouldn't have done as well. Uh, but I just felt like maybe I should use this gas to boost it out. It's getting to September already, and we still have a lot of oil in the ground, as you can see. Actually, September, October, November, December. I sh we should have enough time to get rid of this uh, node here, so I should be totally fine. And because prices are so shitty right now, and we do have the storage space, let's start storing some of this. Okay, thankfully I hired one more mole. We did find another gas node here. This is actually empty now, unfortunately. So, the question is, should I connect these together? Is it really worth the price of, like, $500 to uh, boost this oil through? It's October. No, we should have more than enough time. So I'm just going to fart this rig and uh, get rid of this gas node. Oh, yeah, there we go. Fart, little rig. Fart. <laughs> and hopefully that means there's no more gas on the ground. Okay, 88 cents. I would like to get the early bird bonus. I was hoping for a little higher, but at this point, I don't even know if I'll be able to get all the oil. Actually, the oil is out of the ground. Perfect. So now all I got to do is sell all this oil and then call it a season. There we go. Everything is sold, and I think we're good. I just want to make sure the wagons stop moving. See, there might be something in this guy. I think there is. So there we go. All right, withdraw land lease. We got $166 left. Stop level. Please see no gas. Please see no gas. Yes! Oh, that feels fucking great. Okay, so we spent a lot of money, but uh, we got $4,000 extra bonus for doing so. Uh, I, w I didn't think it was going to work because I felt like there was going to be a few more gas nodes in that ground, but uh, there wasn't. So thankfully, that was a pretty decent season. Not perfect by any means, but uh, definitely decent. But the competition is hot in the tundra. As you can see, 19,000. Uh, Joshua's got 17, and Blanche got 18. Uh, this is kind of scary considering how close we are with the stock prices as well. Okay, guys. Well, that wraps up another season. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Turmoil. We're getting near the end, guys. I hate to say that because you guys seem to really like this, and I appreciate that. But uh, we got about... Uh, a little bit over half of the tundra left, probably a couple episodes at least. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying it, and as always, thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.